Hey guys, it's Dennis here again with Team Deberu and today's video is part number 3 from tutorial series showing you how to connect Volume Checker with Max Bounty Affiliate Network. But before we jump into the content, make sure to join our free Facebook group with Team Deberu by clicking the link below in the description for more advanced strategies how to make money online. So let's have a look to the content. Hello guys, so welcome back to this tutorial. So today is part number three. So the last video showing you how to connect volume tracker with Max Bounty Affiliate Network. So in the part one and part two, we actually created all the elements within the volume tracker. And today we're gonna create a Facebook campaign showing you how to use the tracking links within your Facebook campaign. So let's jump inside the volume. But before we jump to the content, uh, if you haven't watched part one and part two, just make sure to watch that one first. So you can just click the links uh, in the description below and then come back to uh, this video. So here we are inside the volume. So last time we created an affiliate network element, traffic source, lender, offer, and a campaign. And within the campaign, we have our tracking links we're gonna use today. So let's go straight away and let's click up here to our campaign. We're gonna edit. So here are the general, actually uh, general information. We, uh, we did the last time, so in part number two. So we connected the lender and the offer and today we're gonna go to tracking. So click on tracking and it's gonna give you these links. So we have direct tracking URL lender, direct tracking pixel lender and click URL. So this, this link is gonna go within your ad, so on the ad level. This, this pixel we're gonna actually paste within our uh, ClickFunnels template and click URL, we're gonna actually put on the last call to action, so the last answer to be actually redirected to the offer. So let's go and let's finish uh, the ClickFunnels template first. So here is the ClickFunnels. Uh, I have just uh, created this uh, funnel just for this video so what you're gonna do you're gonna click on edit page so here we are so let's go back to volume so this is the click URL which goes on the call to action so the last answer they will click they will get redirected to the offer itself so click here edit survey options outcomes action and custom redirect you're gonna paste this link so go back save so this is it and then we need to add this HTML code which is gonna go to settings and where you have paste your Facebook pixel So up here, exactly head tracking code. So exactly here, you're gonna paste this code. All right. So this is all you need to do. Cool. and go back and save and update settings. So we have actually finished with ClickFunnels. So that's number one. So let's go back to volume. And now we're gonna need to go to uh, Facebook ads. So uh, to the uh, ads manager to create our campaign. So let's go there. Uh, by clicking up here 
So here we are, uh, like always, we use uh, for objective uh, traffic. So click on traffic. So we're not gonna be focusing on uh, creating a campaign today. I just want to show you where to paste the tracking links. So we're gonna just go through quickly. So we're not gonna do pretty much anything here. So let's go, uh, let's change placements because I have uh, created uh, an image for today's tutorial and it is actually a Instagram story image. So let's go and do that. So deselect everything except Instagram stories. Let's go women. And that's it so you always optimize for landing page views daily budget it doesn't matter right now because we are not focusing on that so click continue and we're gonna come up here so I have created one Instagram story uh, image for today's video and this is it so swipe up and win. So win a year's supply of crisps. So yeah, it's just for today's tutorial. That's it. Um, so let's go back to Ads Manager. So we're gonna go down to here. And what we need to do here, where it says website URL, we need to paste our tracking link from the volume. So let's go back to the volume. So where it says direct tracking URL lender. So this is the code that you need to copy. Click it here, copy, go back to ads manager and paste it up here. Cool, so that's it. So let's upload our image, which is up here, upload, download, Swipe up and win, open. Which it doesn't matter for today's video, but I just wanted to show you. Cool, so that's done, that's done, and this is done. Beautiful. Yeah, so that was pretty much everything for today's video. So I just wanted to show you how you can uh, use these tracking links that we created in the part one and part two. And in part three, today's video, we showed you how to use it and where to paste it. So if you have any additional questions, just type it below in the comment sections and we will help you. So all tools I have used, you can get it by clicking the links into the description. So that's all for today. So thank you for watching and see you tomorrow with a new video. Are you struggling with your affiliate marketing business or want to take things to the next level? Allow me to introduce you to Dice University. Dice University is the number one affiliate marketing training platform in the world. Whether you're a beginner or an advanced affiliate marketer, Dice University offers you thousands of different videos with topics such as Facebook, volume, adplexity, and many more of your favorite topics. Step by step, you will learn the secret super affiliate ways to get the most out of each traffic source. Dominate each vertical with our detailed quick start guides. Are you ready to get started? Click the link in the description to sign up today.